Good morrow to the nerds. I, I really don't know what that was. I, 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 I tried to be as entertaining as possible, okay? Don't judge me. I don't judge you. Okay, I kind of judge you a little bit. Did you gain some weight? That's just... I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's, it's noticeable, okay? I'm just telling you. Consider eating a tomato or something. Anyways, um, we have five orbs. Let's go summon, shall we? What? What? You can't do this to me. You just can't. I'm sorry. This makes me... This makes me incredibly upset. You, I've already told you, IS. No more homicide. Hashtag no more homicide. Seriously. Why? Why would you do this to me? Why would you put her... The one character that I really, really just don't want to see murdered over and over and over again into a focus summon. Seriously. Ugh. Okay, well. I'm already saying do not summon on this banner for non-biased reasons. Because obviously it's just... And if you do roll on this, uh, go for colorless and green. Why, you may ask? Well, uh... Because... reasons? Seriously. If you roll any reds at all on this banner, you are dead to me. But uh, I guess we should probably go over the character stuff. Alrighty, so... First up, we have Jafar, who, uh, is, is neat. Um, so I'm just going to tell you that right now there are actually two characters in this banner that are exclusively five stars only, so if you decide to roll for this, you should probably go for them anyways, because, well, they're, they're exclusive to five stars, they have an upped rate here, that means that you will get them more often, and that's a cool thing, obviously. So... Um, the first one, of course, is Jafar. He is, uh, an assassin, in that I guess he has those skills if you really want him to be, you know, that assassin. He has Deathly Dagger, which is exclusive to him, can't be inherited. Um, it, it, it's a nice weapon to have, because after combat, uh, it inflicts defense and resistance minus seven, as seen there. And it also causes damage after the battle. I believe it also stacks with Poison Strike or uh, Death Blow, or whichever of those abilities you really want to use, because why not? I mean, Jafar is an interesting character. I would not really say he's the best assassin. Unfortunately, he has competition from Kagura, who just, for some reason, outdoes him in some ways. But he does have life and death and threat and speed, so he can be pretty substantial of an assassin. I really like him myself. Um, I would, I'm definitely going to be leveling him up just to have another throwing weapon expert along with Frederick. Um, but outside of that, eh, give or take a bit. And our next five star unit here, that is Minerva. Again, exclusive, hey, talking, exclusive only to five stars and a very valuable green axe unit, especially if you have a flyer emblem team. Um... Minerva, of course, has Hot Claire, which is a uh, exclusive weapon only for her and her brother, and cannot be inherited, and it just is basically a killer axe, but with more damage. I mean, you can't really go wrong there. Sacred Cow, because she actually has defense that can be pretty powerful. Life and Death 3, which is cool, and of course, Ward Flyers, which means that she has the uh, ward abilities that come before that. I forget which one she has, but anyways, uh, yeah, there you guys go. Boo. And finally, we have Hana, a focused samurai who you should never kill. She is too delicate. You do this, you do it at your own risk. Stop. Stop. Hashtag no more Hana side. I, I'm really... <laughs> I'm going to keep pitching that until it freaking dies, much like Hana every time someone summons her. Anyways, um, she is the only character that is not a... Exclusive five star, obviously. Uh, she does have life and death. She's a pretty speedy character, but all in all, you'd probably only be summoning her if you were to summon in this in hopes to get her because, well, you're probably planning to kill her and give her life and death to someone else. And life and death, of course, being an exclusive skill only to five stars, she really doesn't have too much out there that would, uh, you know, I mean, Obstruct, a lot of people have found a good way to use it, but Life and Death is probably the one unit you're looking for. One ability you're looking for, um... Sure, just, I, just know that you do this, there's no going back. I will find you. 
and I will just I will cry in front of you. Um, Hana may be cute, but I wouldn't want to fight her. See, guys, even Anna agrees with me. That's right, guys. That's right. Hashtag no more homicide. Just, I, I just, just point that out. No more homicide. And if any of you touch her, any of you, I will know. I have a unique set of skills, and that is mostly sobbing and eating sandwiches. But uh, my other skills include occasionally getting up and doing some work. But you know, mostly just eat, sobbing sandwiches and occasionally sleeping. Just, just so we're clear. Anyways, I'm actually gonna roll for a different banner because I still want to try and see if I can get a different core. And I know a lot of you were like, "Oh, well, never mind." I'm just gonna roll for a colorless because my life is full of misery and sadness. Hooray! Hooray! I hope it's an old man giving me a stamina potion. It's 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 sooner. Okay. Anyways, uh, that was that was a fun little adventure. I was really happy to be a part of this. In that. Uh, I'm not sure what to think about this anymore. I can't believe you would do this to me, I asked. Why would you do this? Why? Have you no decency, sir?